His Royal Highness, the late Fon Angwafo III Solomon Anyengamatu Ndefru was one of the key actors of reunification. The paramount ruler of Mankan actively took part during the Fumban Conference in 1961, which gave birth to the reunification of Cameroon. Born on the 1st of May 1925, Fon Angwafo III was crowned paramount ruler of Mankan dynasty in 1959 on the eve of the independence of Cameroon and most African countries. His role in the political scope of Cameroon will end him the first national vice president of the Cameroon People's Democratic Movement, CPDM, upon creation on the 24th of March 1985 in Bamenda with President Paul Bia at the helm of the party. Since then, he jealously held the position till his disappearance on the night of May 21, 2022. The late Fawn will be remembered for standing and protecting the interests of a one united and indivisible Cameroon, while in his palace in Mankan, considered to be the epic center of separatists. Since the escalation of the crisis in the northwest and southwest regions, Fonangwafo the third had never stopped calling on these separatist fighters to drop their weapons and join in the construction of a one and stronger Cameroon. No language, no culture is better than the other. He has taken all of their old California. They cannot be to Canada. That unity is strength. No man has a diversity. For Nangwafo III was one of the pioneer members of the House of Chiefs in the Northwest Regional Assembly. Being the elders member, he chaired the first ever session of the House before the elections of the Executive Bureau. One week to his disappearance, the late Fawn of Mankon met with the Archbishop of Bamenda, His Grace Andrew Foyankeya, during which the Fawn applauded the efforts of the Church in her developmental strike within Mankon and called for more development to be done especially in the domain of education. The visit of His Grace Andrew Foyankea, which was the first ever visit for an Archbishop to the Palace of Mankon, has been described by many as a visit which spiritually prepared the way for the phone to travel and meet his ancestors. Oh.